One film we're really excited about is Pretty Red Dress. And for those of you who caught the new rom-com, Britcom sensation Rye Lane earlier this year, this is another film coming out of South London, a new director, first-time director, a female voice, a black director, a director of Caribbean and British heritage, telling a really important and timely story about identity, black masculinity. It's a film that explores maybe these kind of offbeat queer aspects of our identity without explicitly being perhaps a gay film. It's not putting queerness into this kind of binary box where it's one thing or the other. It's seeing this as something that might impinge upon all of our lives. How did you afford this? We can't become ourselves until we find ourselves. And I really believe that my little brother Travis is finding himself right now. I would say it's probably a slightly grittier film than you might expect if you do watch the trailer or you're looking at the poster. But at the same time, on the flip side, it's also a musical. The cast are really good, but the real standout is Alexandra Burke. Yes, that's Alexandra Burke. In a kind of reflexive way, she's playing a character auditioning for the Tina Turner musical. And it has these wonderful musical sequences which break up some of the more social realistic aspects of the film. How much is it, hun? Oh, the Lily Marvin, it's 279. Babe, ox if they call it for a bit. Do you think you can hold it to the end of the month? No, oh, I can only hold it for 24 hours, I'm afraid. I'm really sorry. Dion Edwards is going to be here, the director, for a Q&A on Sunday the 18th of June. And we're also peppering a few screenings of Rye Lane around the release of Pretty Red Dress. So you can catch up with that and see them both in tandem as what I'm coining and trademarking at this early stage as the South London new wave. I express myself differently. Be paid by